Hello friends, welcome back to my channel and if you're new, welcome. I am so happy you're here. In today's video, I am doing a deep clean with me. I desperately needed to deep clean my bathroom. It has been a long time coming since I had actually deep cleaned it. So I got that done in this video and then just a few deep cleaning tasks around my house. I hope that you guys enjoy this video. If you do, please give it a thumbs up, make sure you're subscribed, and let's get into this video. Alright friends, so I am first starting in my master bathroom and it had been um, a minute since I had actually deep cleaned this bathroom. I clean it on a regular basis, but deep cleaning is a whole nother story. So um, I had time this week to get it done. This was actually filmed the week before uh, my overtime week. Uh, if you guys didn't know, last week yes last week was prime uh big prime deal days so we were put on overtime and i wanted to get this bathroom together before i had that overtime because i knew that it was something that i had to get done on my to-do list so that is why i'm working on this first thing now these clips were filmed on different days this was filmed on one day and then the next few tasks that i am doing for deep cleaning were filmed on a separate day and I wanted to mention what I'm using right here I'm using the scrub daddy damp duster if you guys have never heard of this thing I will link it down below it is absolutely amazing it helps get all the hair off of the sink if any other wives out there or girlfriends or whatever have um, significant others that have hair everywhere or even if you have hair everywhere I can't even totally blame it on my husband all the time because I have hair everywhere um it helps greatly getting all of that hair up I always struggled with like it sticking to everything and then the hair sticking to everything and then I can't get it up so I highly recommend trying it and it also works great on dust too so if you're interested I will link that down below but I just wanted to mention that so I am just finishing up by cleaning up the sink area and then I am going to put everything back inside here and I'm going to refill our q-tips and cotton balls and stuff like that and then we were are going to get started on the bathtub <music>
All right, now I am starting off by cleaning everything off around the bathtub so that I can get started on cleaning the bathtub. Now, I did want to mention, I've mentioned this before, but it's been a while since you guys have seen me clean my bathroom. I do have Giovanni's bath toys in here. He does like to take baths inside our bathtub. In fact, he probably uses the bathtub, the bathtub more than anybody. Um, so that is why you see all of that just laying around. Um, so now I am just spraying it down with some scrubbing bubbles. Um, this actually helps to get all of that mildew um, mold and stuff. I didn't have much mold here. I, I actually get more mold in my uh, shower for some odd reason. But um, this works just as great here and it does a really, really good job. And then I am using this shower scrubber that Andrew had gotten for me off of TikTok shop. Um, I'm not able to link it down below, but I can try to find a similar one for you guys on Amazon. Um, if it's not down below, then I couldn't find a similar one, but I will try to find a similar one for you guys. Um, I highly suggest using this if it is something that you are interested in. Um, it definitely helps save my back with all the scrubbing and everything. I don't have to bend down as much and it is just great. And if you see me struggling with this, um, it was because it needed to be charged and I kept like trying to charge it a little bit and then use it. And yeah, so I was struggling with trying to keep it alive until I was done with this bathroom. And so now I'm just rinsing this bathtub and then we are going to move on into the shower. Okay, before we go into the shower, I'm actually going to clean our toilet. Um, this has actually been something that I, I actually clean this like every single week because Gio staying inside our room with us and sleeping with us, he does tend to use our bathroom a lot. And um, if you don't have little children, um, you might not know this, but they are not the best at aiming inside the toilet. So I have to clean this area a lot more frequently than any area in this bathroom, but it's okay. Um, it's not that hard to do. What I do is I use disinfectant wipes to wipe down the toilet. And then I use my Clorox toilet wand. I absolutely love this thing. It is amazing. And it's better than I feel. I feel it's better than using like a toilet brush. Um, I th think it's just more sanitary to do it this way. Um, just to clean the toilet this way. It's a lot, like I said, sanitary. So um, I will also link this down below if you guys are interested in purchasing this. Um, I know that they sell it on Amazon and I just get the refills off of Amazon as well. Okay, so now we are in the shower and I am spraying down the shower with the scrubbing bubbles and I was actually, I actually let this sit for a few minutes before I came back in um, to the shower and I used the shower or the scrubber that I was using on my bathtub inside the shower and I view I was using two different attachments for this there's a pointy attachment that I use for the edges um, it helps to get all of that mold out from the edges that they're very hard it's very hard in the shower to even film um, that's why I only have like one view of this so I'm sorry about that but um, anyway, so I'm using a, the pointy edge right now to get into the cracks and then I'm going to use the flatter one that I used on the bathtub for all of the walls and then I'm going to be done inside this bathroom.
All right, now we are on a different day and now we are downstairs. Basically, all I had to do was I had to catch up on my dusting downstairs. Um, this has been something that I've been neglecting recently. Uh, there's just more other tasks that I have been trying to focus on. Um, so I am just dusting off this whole entire area and I had actually just cleaned um, everywhere in this living room and everything. Uh, so I just all I had to do was dusting in here so I'm working on dusting this bookshelf and then all the walls and the fireplace mantle and everything like that and then I am going to move into the dining room and dust all of the high areas in my dining room and then move on into dusting into the kitchen All right, now I am cleaning off of the table because as you know, when you dust, you have to clean everything below it. Um, I had actually recently just did all of my deep cleaning in here. So I this was the one thing that I saved was deep cleaning my uh, table. But all I do with that is I just spray it with my Lysol disinfectant spray and just disinfect it. So now we are moving into the kitchen and I'm dusting all of the light fixtures the top of these cabinets get really dusty and they get um, spider webs we do have a lot of spiders that like to come into our house and make spider webs so um, I try to stay on top of this but things happen so I was able to get this done today and I'm so happy that I was able to get this done and after I do all of this I'm going to start cleaning some miscellaneous things in my kitchen like I said this wasn't like a huge like kitchen deep clean or anything it was just some deep cleaning tasks that I have been neglecting recently and needed to get on top of so I'm going to start doing that after I clean off all of the counters of course <laughs>
Okay, and now I have moved on into the entryway. Um, this is our entryway of our house, and I was just uh, dusting the walls and then this light fixture. It had been a minute since I had actually deep cleaned this area, and now I am just cleaning the windows right here. I had actually cleaned the outside windows um, just recently. I just didn't do the inside one, so I'm getting that done right here. And then I'm going to clean off this entry table right here. The top of it really needed to be cleaned really bad, so I am going to be getting that done. And then we are going to move on into the downstairs bathroom. All right, and this is actually the end of this video or towards the end of this video, I should say. This isn't like the only thing I'm doing right now is just dusting in here, but um, I had needed to do some high dusting in this bathroom. So I, this is a very small bathroom. It did not take me very long to do any dusting in here. So I did all the du high dusting and now I am dusting off this little shelf that's above our toilet. And then I am going to just start cleaning the rest of the bathroom after, of course, I dust this picture frame. I am going to clean this mirror and then I'm going to clean the sink and then you're going to see me clean that little shelving unit um, right above the toilet. And then I'm going to do the same kind of cleaning that I do with my toilet upstairs in this bathroom. And then we will be done. <laughs> All right, guys, we are at the end of this video. All I'm going to do is clean this toilet and then I will be done in here. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it gave you some cleaning motivation to do some deep cleaning on your to-do list. Let me know what kind of deep cleaning you have to do on your to-do list. I would love to know that. And I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for all of your support and all of your patience these past couple weeks. I know I've been a little rocky with my uploading overtime came and it just really took it all out of me so I am trying to get better or back on my filming schedule so hopefully I can have one up every week from now on thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed give it a thumbs up make sure you're subscribed and I will see you in a new video next week bye guys